We're on a cliff and I've got a bucket of water attached to this hose. Try to figure out a way to stop it from pulling because that hose gets very heavy. 30 meters straight down, there's a big cliff there. You see the bottom. This is the cliff it's going off and in the distance there, there's the hose. There's the hose coming down and to our splitter. Now I'll turn it on and let's hear the see the pressure go up. And nothing happened. That's that's just great. Um, I'll eject this one because there should be a bit of air to release. Yeah, it's coming. Okay, we got some pressure there. 25, what was it? PSI. So, from the hose end, let's have a look. Oh, that's pretty weak. <laughs> now I'll add the adapter on. So we're at the bottom of the hill. I'll turn the, it's about a 25 meter drop. I'll turn the pressure gauge on. We're sitting at about 23 PSI. Now I'll turn the hose on. It's pretty good. Pretty good blast there. And we're sitting at 22 PSI. Now I'll just take the end off. I feel like it goes further when I turn it down. And it's, it doesn't look so impressive all of a sudden. I got climbers and sheep over there watching what I'm doing. Get a shot of that guy. <laughs> okay, so let's uh, run through. Yeah, I think going full blast kind of slows it down. Shit, that's pretty good, eh? You probably can't see any of this. All right, so I'll go back home and test the generator at 22 PSI. Thanks for watching. Oh, that's a lot of hope.